Hi, I'm Lauren Fix, the car coach. Long road trips are part of what New York summers are all about, but sometimes sitting in the back seat can leave you with a little bit of an upset stomach. Here are some tips to make your trip a lot more fun. Car sickness results from a conflict between the eye and the ear. The inner ears detect the car is moving, but the eyes focus in the car. The brain receives conflicting signals and nausea results. Instead of not taking your family road trip, follow these tips to avoid car sickness. Choose the right foods. Before and during your trip, eat bland foods. Avoid spicy food, greasy food, and alcohol consumption. Bring along crackers, ginger candy, mints, soda water, and ginger ale to help settle your stomach. Keep your eyes on the scenery. Reading books, watching movies, and playing video games can all cause or worsen car sickness. Look outside the car instead, preferably out the front window. Find a focal point and keep your eyes on that. Take short breaks. Give your stomach a break by stopping the car, especially if you're feeling queasy. Walk around a bit and get some fresh air. Call shotgun. Sitting in the front seat can reduce the conflicting signals of your brain. Looking forward is better than looking out the side window because the scenery seems to fly by very quickly. Do not put car seats in the front seat or change rear-facing seats to forward. Try over-the-counter medications as an option, such as Dramamine, Benadryl, or Bonine. If all else fails, get a prescription from your doctor. Be prepared for motion sickness reaction by buying lined disposable bags. These work at home as well. Car sickness shouldn't prevent car rides and road trips. It may take time to find the right combination of tips to help you feel better, but start with short rides, see what works, and work up to the longer drives. Check with your doctor for proper medical advice. My tips are suggestions and certainly not a substitute. For more information, go to YNN.com. I'm Lauren Fix, The Car Coach.